Hey lovelies, I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, psychic medium and divine channeler, and this is the weekly Capricorn reading, which has took me three attempts to record that because I couldn't say Capricorn. My words kept coming out upside down and back to front. <laughs> so Capricorns, what do we need to know this week? Let's have a look and see. It's... um. It does feel very much like you are stepping into this energy of being more in alignment with yourself than you have for a few weeks because it's felt very much like you've been giving a little bit too much energy away to other people. Um, and it's like the energy has just slowed down a little bit where you can catch up with yourself and get yourself back to how you should be feeling. In alignment, being a little bit more focused on yourself and having that inner knowing because it does feel very much like you've got an inner knowing of that what you've been waiting for. The energy of... Um, where everything falls into place and that gives you an element of freedom back because although it feels very much like although you've been knowing it's been happening you haven't really focused a lot of energy on that um but moving forward you've sort of got more in alignment with yourself more trusting that knowing and so you're very much in alignment with things which are going to be flowing towards you a lot quicker than they have been it very, feels very much like i want to say breaking free from sort of old ways, old things that have been, you've possibly just needed to clear that last bit from. And it's like, oh my God, it's in front of me. It's happening. It's all come into place. And that gives you an element of freedom. I want to say freedom because it's what you've been waiting for. And it's that freedom of fully embracing love life the life you're meant to have and that is a massive freedom moment because although you've known it's been like you've had to keep yourself all together in some way and it's been difficult to feel free and fully let go of yourself. It feels to an element you've been sort of keeping yourself very structured, restricted feeling. But then it's going to be like, whew, it's all happening. It's all falling into place what you have been waiting for. Okay, let's have a look at the cards. <laughs> Well, it's funny actually because the first two cards are healing chaos and simplicity and that really does feel very much like we've gone from this healing chaos that is a part of your past it feels very much like you're letting go of the last drabs of that chaos and you're very much going into this I know it's simple nothing has to be as complicated as I'm as I've been led to believe as I've been making it and now I'm really falling into this knowing and it happening energy okay and with that becomes your openness because with that inner knowing you're very open and you should be listening to that inner guidance which you are getting you know you can feel it it's happening you've got it's almost like you know it's happening because it's like it, you feel it in your heart before it's happening in reality. But that's taking a little bit of getting used to because there is an element of you like 
I never actually believed we would get here fully. I had the knowing, but my belief was a little bit clouded by past situations. And then we've got <laughs> the freedom card and you really are in alignment and you are feeling free and you're soaring forwards and upwards. And it's like massive transformational new beginnings of feeling free trust that inner knowing because it is just about to fall into place for you <laughs> and then we've got the gateway card and you are walking through that gateway into that new beginning it's very much i want to say a fresh start but the fresh start started when you went through your awakening and began your growth but this is really going into the gateway of the next chapter <laughs> that love you have been waiting for and then we've got the purity card stay pure stay genuine stay very much in your own energy and don't allow others to affect it because other people around you can bring you into lower energies and less positive energies and your energy is pure it is genuine and it's important to focus on that because you are going forwards things are moving forwards it just feels like everything's falling into place and you're not going to believe it but it's going to give you this freeing feeling it is, it is quite a magical energy which is happening. And then we've got the miracles card because miracles do happen and it's going to be a miracle when this, I know I've talked generally through this reading because I know many people want different things, but there is this element of love, this element of this connection, the element of this, you've been wanting it, but you don't believe it's gonna happen. And oh my God, it's happening. It's all, all of a sudden in front of me because you can feel them close to you. Trust in those feelings. They are real and you need to believe those feelings because your miracle is just about to happen. It is like there, it is about to fall into place. There's two of you moving to f forwards in quite a free way as you jump through out the sea together and happy. Happiness together. I'm so excited. Let's have a look at the universe card. Instead of praying for an outcome, I pray for the highest good for all. And that is what's happening. That is what's falling into place. Your prayers have been heard. Okay, lovelies, thank you so very much for joining me. It's always a pleasure. Please do like and comment on the video if you feel drawn. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Thank you to each and every single one of you for supporting the channel. I look forward to seeing you next week. In the meantime, don't forget to watch the daily videos. Take care. Stay safe. Namaste. Bye.